In this screencast, we're going to walk through the procedure for how to find, take, and record your mathematics proficiency exam at Grand Valley State University. The proficiency exam is computer-based and administered using WebWork, a system that we use for online math homework. First, on the web, access the main web page for the proficiency exam using the URL that you see on the screen. You'll be asked to provide your login information once you arrive at this page. This should be the same username and password you provide to log into your GVSU email. After you've logged in, find the course you need and the exam you wish to take. The course is currently using the proficiency exam are Math 110, Math 122, and Math 123. When you are ready to take the exam, click on the link for the exam you wish to take. But don't click on the link unless you are really ready to take the exam, because clicking on the link will start the exam and start a timer that will end the exam after either 30 or 60 minutes, depending on your course. To keep the exam's contents secure, I can't show you the exams here in the screencast, but I have a similar exam set up here that shows you how things work. The exam consists of questions whose answers you select by either clicking a button or selecting a correct option from a drop-down menu. The Math 110 exam consists of 50 such questions spread across three pages and has a time limit of 60 minutes. The Math 122 and Math 123 exams have 20 questions on two pages and a time limit of 30 minutes. On the placement exams, a timer will appear in the top right corner of your browser window to remind you how much time is left. At any time during the test, you can preview your answers by clicking on the Preview Problems link in one of the question boxes. You can move back and forth between the pages before you submit your work, so if you want to go back to think some more about a particular problem, you can do so. However, you're not allowed to stop the proficiency exam and start over again at a later time. If you log out of WebWork or close your browser before the exam is finished, the timer on the exam will keep running and your work will become inaccessible after time is up. So make sure to have a full 30 or 60 minutes, depending on your course, set aside in which to take your exam. If you complete your work before time runs out, just make sure to preview your work and check it over for errors. Then click the Grade Test button to submit your work. Remember, your work will not be submitted until you click the Grade Test button. Once your work is submitted, you'll get instant feedback on how you did. A screen will come up that confirms that your work was recorded, gives you the score that you earned, and will give you the time that you took. And that's it. Good luck on your proficiency exam.